How bad? This is Chef Otis again. And I'm in uh, my favorite grocery store. I'm in H-E-B in uh, Missouri City, Texas. Today I'm gonna do some guacamole from scratch. And I'm gonna do a kale blueberry yogurt smoothie. That's all I'm having today is liquid today. The guacamole is for our aura, our target jet. I wanna show you guys how to pick your avocados. Right. This right here is not, it's too soft. It's, it's overripe and it's no good. I had a Mexican guy named Jose who showed me the proper way to pick uh, avocados. Matter of fact, he was a coworker of mine. You wanna put the avocado in the palm of your hand. It should be firm to the touch, very firm. You got that? You got it? Put it on the avocado. It should be firm, like this. That is a ripe avocado. I got four good ones here. I also have some organic kale. Oh, hey, how you doing, man? Good to see you. This is my organic kale here. This is my organic kale. I'm gonna use this today to make my smoothie. I'm also gonna get some, uh, some blueberries. I'm gonna use these blueberries here in my smoothie. And these are really nice, low price. Blueberries are antioxidants, full antioxidants today. A lot, a lot of, uh, health benefits in kale. As you know, kale is your superfood. This is gonna be all vegan today. There's gonna be no solid food today for me. And uh, I'm also gonna get some organic bananas. You wanna make sure your bananas are organic and they got a lot of green in them. And I'm gonna show you these are really hybrids, but I'm gonna show you what a real banana looks like if you follow me over here. Now, these are your burro bananas right here. This is your real banana. So, as you can see, you see that? These are the bananas that Dr. Sebi was talking about. The burro banana is your real banana. This one here is a hybrid. This is a hybrid here. So I'm gonna go with the real banana and I'm gonna put the hybrids back. How about that? Okay, this is uh, Chef Otis and I'm doing a liquid today. I'm doing a liquid fast today. And I'm also going to do some guacamole. The guacamole, you make it from scratch. All you need is fresh avocados. You're going to need uh, some cilantro, sea salt, fried black pepper, and I'm going to add some pico de gallo to that. You like some pico de gallo. Look how beautiful the produce are. This is a uh, we're in the uh, H-E-B store in Missouri City, Texas. And this is one of my favorite departments. All your live food is here in this area here. All your live foods are on the, your live foods are on the outer furs of the store. Your dead food is in the center of the store. So if you want to live long, eat live foods. So stop eating dead food so much. Normally, I make my pico de gallo from scratch. I'm gonna take a shortcut today. I'm gonna take a shortcut and find my pico de gallo already made up. It's right over here. And I'm gonna go with a medium pico de gallo. This has cilantro in it. This has cilantro in it. We're gonna go with mild. Talk to Jess if you want mild pico de gallo. It already has the cilantro, onions, uh, and tomatoes already diced up and everything, and this is a good way of doing it, okay? I'm 
also going to get, uh, while I'm here, like I said, we are, we are going to do liquids today, a guacamole. It's not really considered a solid meal, but avocados are in season in this part of the world. You go down to Mexico and South Texas, the, weather, the temperature today, the day, winter's here very mild. So a lot of the fruits you can get year round here because it's 60 something degrees today. But a lot of these avocados coming out of South America, Mexico, different areas like that, which the climate is hot year round. And avocados are grown right here in Texas also. That's going to just about do it. Uh, I want to thank you guys for tuning in with Chef Otis again and the grocery section at HEB in Missouri City, Texas. And I will see you guys again soon. And thanks for tuning in. Check us out on Facebook, Instagram. She's on Twitter, Top of Jet. Uh, you'll also find my, on my website, ChefOtisWagner.com. And we want to give a shout out to uh, my son. A shout out to Chef Lawrence Wagner in Brooklyn, New York. And a shout out to our Supreme Grandmaster, Dr. Malachi New York, who is the uh, founder and the commander in chief of the original Egyptian Masonic Lodge worldwide. That's going to do it. Well, I do, and have a great day and a great life.